Hi, everybody. My name is Daryl, and I hope you've seen some of my videos, but if you're not, quickly, um, I'm gonna do things a little bit differently today. I just got back from the bins in Seattle, and, um, and I haven't even started going through this stuff to really take a good look at it. And so I thought I would um, share that with you and then probably edit it heavily. <laughs> but anyway, so let's start with what I got, all right? The shoes were really quite good. And I'm gonna turn this around. So these are cute, are they not? They're from Halogen. But these were, well, these were the ones I'm happiest about. These are from Vince and they're my size. And then I like these, they're a tiny bit too big and a tiny bit too small for my husband. So, um, and it looks like there was a, a little bit of dog chewing there, but I don't care. I just think they're awesome. So we'll see what the comps come up with for these. So now for the stuff. These are from Nordstrom and I think they're silk. Yeah mulberry silk no less so i'm guessing they're pajama bottoms these are slides from robert clergy i don't know how you say that clergy <laughs> anyway there's where that is pretty cool aren't they Kind of a Japanese influence. And I think that's it for the shoes. These are, I'm gonna have to run a comp. They are Core 10 leggings. So this is kind of cute. This is from Love Stitch. I think it would make um, a good swimsuit cover up um, because it crosses over here, but really this is kind of the only thing that's keeping it shut. <laughs> so what else do I have? Oh, so many things I just want to try on. Now I was looking at this and I'm pretty sure it is Lululemon only I, well, maybe it's not. It has an unknown tag. It looks a lot like a Lululemon. Oh, here's what it is. Oh, almost as good. Patagonia. This is a Power Y Lululemon top. You know, maybe I should put this on and then I can try all my things on. Hmm, why don't we see how that works? <laughs> that idea didn't work, but uh, we'll go back to this. This is J. Crew. And it has these cute side slits. Pretty cute. Even better, that last J. Crew red sweater was 100% cashmere, which I didn't realize at the time. This is from Lucky, and I really like this. This is super cute. velvet. So this is cute. I'm going to scoot a bit this way. This is from Zara and it's got belt loop so it needs its belt. Here we go. <laughs> I'm keeping my hands here because it really needs something to cinch it in I think but other than that it's brand new with tags. I put on the Nordstrom silk pants and I don't know, it could be that maybe they just are regular old pants. They would look really good with um, a silk cami. There you go. And this is a Free People shirt. So right now it's like in pajama mode. Look how comfy this looks. <laughs> so these pants are the Code 10. And they've got a, a, a waist, high-rise waist that dips here. 
and they're a really nice fit. Boy, they feel really good. So I have to remind you that this is the first time that I've tried any of these things on or really even gotten a, a pretty good look at what the labels were because the lighting's bad, you know, there. And at the bins, too, you don't want to be flashing around um, what you've got in your cart. Um, there have been some instances of theft lately, which doesn't make, you know, those of us that go there all the time very happy. It's, I don't know. But anyway, this top is uh, from Cooperative, and I think it's silk. Cute. And these pants are um, a knit, kind of like misook. Um, and these are from Ming Wang. And I haven't done a comp on them, but I, I know from selling tops from this brand that um, that it's a, got a healthy price tag. But these are really cute. I kind of like them. <laughs> the whole outfit. Well, I was hoping this would be more of a, a loose fit, but it's okay. It'd be really cute on a hot summer day. It's from a brand called The Arc, which I know nothing about. So it's knee length. Now, this is an interesting um, bit that I've got on. Um, this is a um, cami top. It's from, I think it was from Halogen. This is from a brand called Maria Vasquez. Vasquez? Marie Martina? Let's take a look at it. Christina Marquez. And, um, it's this, this, um, you know, long kind of wrap thing that I think still works really well. And especially with uh, these silk pants that are also from Nordstrom. Again, they have a drawstring waist. And, um, you know, you can do a lot of stuff with these sweaters. Let's see, you know, like you can do this. Just wear it like this. This has got a beautiful hand to it. It's really gorgeous. So I'm gonna run some comps and uh, see what I can find out about it. And I'm really happy with these silk pants as well. This pair has pockets. <laughs> and again, someone liked those navy blue Nordstrom silk pants. <laughs> I'm glad I got them. This is really a nice jacket from Marmot. This one um, has a lining in it, which is bonus points. And of course, I love this color. And the skirt is Eileen Fisher, and it's vintage, but her fabrications uh, last forever and ever. This is a beautiful kind of eggplant. Uh, color stretch silk. I wanted to show you the skirt with um, a cashmere sweater here. So this looks a little more like how I would wear it anyway. So this dress needs some high heels. This is from a brand called Love Rain. And I I think it's got like New Year's Eve or cruise ship <laughs> written all over it. Speaking of cruise ship, that's why I grabbed this one. I just thought this would be the perfect day dress or um, swimsuit cover up. Uh, good thing to wear when you want to look pulled together yet stay nice and cool and comfortable. So I was pretty happy to find this whole set. I didn't realize that MWL was made well. So, and now I have, I've put it on, but I haven't even looked at it. So <laughs> bear with me. <laughs> I think I would like to wear it with a t-shirt and then carry the sweatshirt around. Although, I don't know. I think this is all right. 
So this asymmetric um, top from a brand called Oak will probably not remain being a keeper in um, my wardrobe. It's too close to my skin color, I think. Um, though I don't know, it might look cute with white pants, but these are um, Athleta and they're a cargo pant. And I'll show them, uh, well, I don't know, what do you think? They're pretty cute. Just not with this top. <laughs> okay, they look better with this jacket, only this jacket is for my son. And it's from a brand called Outdoor Research. And, uh, but that goes good with my pants, huh? <laughs> This is 100% wool top by Jay Lindenberg. And um, I'm not sure if it's a men's shirt or a women's shirt. Beautiful. This is cuter than I thought it would be. <laughs> Normally I run a million miles away from things like this. But this is really cute. This has no brand and no size on it. And so as you can see, it's a, a, a seamless ribbed knit top and it matches the pants. So, see the thing is the pants are high enough and the shirt is low enough <laughs> to cover my, my uh, crease in my middle. And I noticed that, that I was showing you the back of these athletic pants with the pockets sticking out. <laughs> <laughs> and another one of these rib tops that I really like to work out in these. They're really comfortable. And another piece, this is from Halogen and it's 100% cashmere. And I think this is a men's shirt. Not sure. Sure is comfy with these leggings. <laughs> this is super cute. This is brand new with tags. It's from Blue Pepper. And I think I saw this dress at Marshall's this summer. <laughs> anyway, it's a tiered dress. And I'll do a spin. My favorite thing to do. Oh, this is really, really comfy. This is my favorite part of coming home from the bins is looking at everything and trying it on and you know seeing how it all fits and stuff. Um, this, I'm gonna to have to double check what the brand was. Um, I did check to see that I would be able to get it on, but I had no idea what it would look like. So here we go. Cute. Has all of this smocking all the way through the whole, whole top, front and back. And I think it's an anthropology brand. Anyway, it looks far better on me than I thought it would. <laughs> Let me show you a couple of things that did not work in the interim. I did hi have high hopes for this sparkly strapless bodysuit. <laughs> I'm dead serious. <laughs> um, it is a medium, but it comes to about, you know, came to about here on me. So it's like a petite size. Um, got some things for my husband. These now, I haven't even looked at them, but I'm pretty sure they're leather. They're from Wilfred. And they say, oh, I guess they're not leather. Man, they sure make a good fake leather. <laughs> These are a size two, I believe. Anyway, they are really, really super cute. They're a high rise with a straight leg. So I will sell these on my um, uh, eBay store for a heck of a lot less than they are now in the stores. Gosh, just think if they'd been my size. I would have been really happy. So I got this jacket. This is a down jacket. And it is Polo Ralph Lauren. 
And uh, I just wanted to show you with these Madewell high rise um, vintage, the perfect vintage jeans. And I have to agree that they are a great fit. And I got them. Just perfect. Here I can just Okay, ready to go out and do something. I could steal this coat from my husband. See, I have it pulled up. He would wear it like, he'd probably wear it like this. I wanted to show you the label here. So a couple more things that I didn't think would work at all. I didn't expect this, um, the cost sweater to fit. It's, I think, a 36. And, uh, but it does, it fits really pretty nicely without being, you know, too tight. And then these are um, Babaton pants from Aritzia. And I own a couple of pair of these and they are really by far my favorite pants. I just love these. So, isn't this pretty? Ooh. Oh, did I say it's cashmere? Well, of course it is. <laughs> 34. Okay, so let's see what this looks like. These are kind of out of my comfort zone. I pretty much don't wear khaki pants, but you know, they've been a big seller for the last several seasons, you know, as being the perfect neutral. Um, so these are from Uniqlo and they're just a drawstring uh, not a jogger, but just a relaxed hem pant. And then this sweater, love, 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 is merino wool from Everlane. Kind of a boxy fit. An absolutely pristine shape. This is the kind of stuff that I really like to get at the bins. This is from a brand called Boho Me. And you know, if I were to look for it, I wouldn't know where to find it. And I think it's cute as a, just a summer dress, but I think it would make a great swimsuit cover up. But here, let's give you a look at it. See, and we'll give it a twirl. It's got a good, yep. It has a good twirl and it has a cute back. You can see this, I don't know if you can. Super easy, soft, lightweight, tissue uh, thin fabric. This is from, um, oh, what's the Lucky Spa brand? Lucky Lotus. Cute. Oops. <laughs> How come this turns on when I don't want it to, but when I want it to, it takes 15 clicks. So this is the dress from Zara that that someone had started to hem up and you know all Goodwill had to do was take the pins out. But anyway, let me show you how awesome this is. It's an all over knit with the ribbing uh, through the top to here. It's got plenty of room. It isn't not tight at all. And I paired it up with the um, Vince shoes. Oh my gosh, more tempered, more twirls. This doesn't twirl that well. Oh, I'm gonna show you this as well. It looks great on, um, this is from uh, Halogen, I think. And it is uh, kind of like a, a throw vest kind of thing. Uh, I don't know, like a kimono kind of. There you go. Anyway, I didn't have anything to put it on with. I guess I could have earlier, but um, there's that. And then this skirt is from Max Mara and it's from the Max Mara Leisure line. And it looks like it's new with tags. And it's just this pleated skirt. 
and it has some weight to it. It's like a, a pleated um, cotton knit with a really nice um, lining. More the same, I think. Oh, there's the lining. Beautiful. So the other thing I love to do is to run comps when it's not being frustrating. <laughs> um, it's frustrating when you can't find things. Um, but uh, um, this will be fun. I have uh, two more things to show you. And that's it. So this is beautiful. I need to take my uh, D pillar to it, but this is from Project X, Project something, Nadam, which uh, Nadam does all the cashmere stuff uh, that is responsibly sourced. So uh, it has side slits. Super cute. So I have one last thing to show you. And um, oh, I was kind of uh, hoping that it wasn't as small as I thought it was, but it is. <laughs> this is a white blazer and the brand is The Row. And I need not say anything else, huh? Isn't it gorgeous? So um, I think it's wearable kind of year round. So I'll kind of take a look at it and decide what I'm gonna do with it. Whether I list it now or list it later, um, it will end up on my uh, um, World Peace Clothing eBay store. So keep your eye out for that. Um, as you can see, this hat appeared from nowhere and I got that today too. And then I got these for my husband. See, I am getting in vacation mode. I like to... Um, start looking at vacation stuff for next year about now because then as long as I know that I have to put a swimsuit on in a couple of months well it just kind of keeps everything on the down low <laughs> so um let me know how you th think this worked I didn't get to clean anything up or iron it or put it together or anything but I'll tell you what it's it was sure fun for me we'll see you later